Do you like doors, pros and death? All of this and more in today's episode. Let's play! Hey guys and welcome to, well, welcome to a whole new series. <laughs> um, today we're gonna start playing Death's Door. That's such a hard name to, uh, hard name to say, at least for me. Yeah, this is, uh, this is the, the second uh, game on the channel. I am absolutely, absolutely excited uh, to be playing this game. I... I've been looking forward to it for quite a while now, and um, it seems that uh, uh, that it's finally time for us to to jump into it. Before we get started, I want to mention something. Um, actually, a few things. First things first. The um, I know you probably saw the intro, and that intro is not final. Um, that intro is basically just. That's actually the sketch of the intro, uh, I think I should rather say. And this is kind of an idea I... Um, actually, my girlfriend came up with. Um, you know, doing the, the intro before a game, uh, game pops up, sometimes it's not that easy because maybe I don't have enough time, maybe there's something else that I need to focus on and stuff like that. And sometimes recording and drawing and all that can take a huge amount of time. Since I started this channel, I've been sleeping like three hours a night, tops, I think. And um, and I still don't get to do everything that I want to do. So um, somehow to ease that process a little bit, I think. We were actually talking and this idea came of what if the, uh, the first video or the first few videos actually don't have, don't have the, the finished intro. And what they do have, on the other hand, is the rough sketch. Like, the just the general placement of elements and something really, really... I don't want to say really, really fast, but definitely not final. And that's kind of what you saw right now. And I just want to let you know that that's just a sketch. And as we progress with this game, that intro is going to look better and better and better. As soon as I finish it, obviously, that's when I'm going to be using it as well. So, uh, that's enough about the uh, about the intro. The second thing that I would like to talk about, and sort of the third thing uh, at the same time, I've had some issues with this game, and haven't even started playing it, basically. Uh, what I mean by this is, I would get some really weird sort of dropped frames, I guess we could call them. It's like the like the character has some vibration into it and he, he keeps moving but like just really really small movements and this is not the uh, most complex uh, game ever graphically speaking um, and I have a uh, 3080 um, and and so I should now uh, I should not have this type of problems, but at the same time, when I was playing, I felt like I was playing in 20, 30 FPS. I have three monitors. On the main one, I was playing with like 50 FPS tops if I was lucky. On the second monitor, I was playing with 30 FPS, I think. And on the third monitor, for some reason, I was playing with seven FPS. Uh, playing is an exaggeration, obviously, but. I don't know what causes this kind of problem and it frustrated me and I spent hours trying to fix this and I was not able to. I almost gave up on the idea of um, of starting the Death, uh, Death's Door uh, series. I kept an eye on the uh, Steam Community Hub, I think it's called, for, um, for Death's Door and actually someone found a fix for it. I don't know if it's something permanent, I'm not sure if that's something that the developers of the game will have to sort of patch. I have no idea, I'm, I'm not necessarily <laughs> a techie guy, <laughs> so I don't know how this issue is going to be resolved. But someone in the community tab or community hub, I don't even know what it's called on Steam, uh, came up with a solution and I tried it out and it works. And because 
I was able to try it out and see that it actually works. I decided, you know what, who knows, maybe on YouTube, more people will be able to see it. Uh, maybe not everybody spends time in the uh, community tab on Steam. Maybe it helps out some people. So all you have to do is to go in the NVIDIA control panel, go to uh, 3D settings, manage 3D settings, and in the global settings, go to um, vertical sync and turn it off. And as soon as I did that, everything worked everything worked perfectly so I hope this helps like I said I don't know if this is something that you have to do from now on when you play this game or if, if they are uh, if they're gonna patch it or not but you know if this helps then terrific I'm I'm happy that it did and um, also I want to use this chance to say thank you to, um, to the person who came up with, uh, with the idea on the, uh, community, in the community hub, uh, hub. Without further ado, let's actually jump into Death's Door. I'm so excited about this game. Now arriving at Reaping Commission headquarters. I like how the um, the lights have, um, you know, like like a finite, <laughs> um, you know, uh, point when uh, where they stop. Although it seems like the bus is kind of floating in the air. End of the line. Okay. Oh, so much better. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, this is perfect. Okay, well, let's see. I can't believe how smooth it actually runs right now. Ain't got no souls, ain't got no shinies, ain't got no worries. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, that's one way uh, of looking at things. Uh, ticket office closed. Gone to fix a broken pipe. Back in 3-4 years. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> that's, uh, that's a big, big trip for a pipe. Uh, yeah, you're clear. Move it along, bud. Am I though? Am I though? <laughs> so I uh, actually played this game for like, I don't know, 20 minutes I think before I got frustrated uh, with the uh, <laughs> with the problems that it had. So, um, but I did manage to walk around and, um, you know, get a sense of this place and I actually found something oh it's not here it's actually higher on the higher level uh well 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 chandler the handler <laughs> look who showed up for work no worms for you because only the early bird catches never mind <laughs> anyway it's your lucky day i actually have a soul for you to reap and not just any soul, a giant soul. Think of the commission on that. I hope you haven't forgotten your training, stay on your talons, giant souls don't often go peacefully. Dropping in your door for you now. Well, thank you, uh, Chandler the Handler. Uh, with a soul that size, you might even be able to afford some time off. But remember... Your door will remain open until you return with your designated soul. I didn't... Um, when I saw some footage of this game, I wasn't sure if this is a, a bug or it's meant to, you know, vibrate like that. Is this meant to be like an ominous... feeling? <laughs> While your door is open, you will be mortal, and you will age, so get it done quickly. That's actually interesting. 
reaping souls the power uh, to power the doors so we can reap more souls and the cycle repeats forever a rat base huh anyway get to it and be careful if you die it's gonna be a lot of paperwork and i don't have the time well as long as your uh, reasons for it are pure <laughs> Oh man, this is so smooth. I'm so happy about this. I, I really, really want to play this game and uh, I'm so happy that someone managed to find a fix for it. Okay, so this is what I randomly found. This is a... Um, this is an umbrella. A discarded umbrella. It's just the thing to keep your feathers dry in grim weather. You can equip it from the menu... Uh, from the weapons menu. Okay, well... Uh, let's see. This is the uh, the basic that combo. This is the uh, bow, and this is the charged attack or the heavy attack, whatever you want to call it. And this is the dodge heavy attack, I suppose. Now let's look at the umbrella. Uh, this one. Okay, so. It kind of seems pretty similar, I think, to the uh, to the sword, apart from the fact that the dodge uh, with the umbrella is a stab instead of a uh, vertical slash. But we are going to keep the sword for now, and uh, yeah, let's uh, let's check out our very first door. Okay. <laughs> Tap space to roll. Okay. I'm not sure what these guys are. But they follow you around. <laughs> and apparently they get stuck sometimes. Oh, did I? Yep, I scared them off. <laughs> look, look at him checking me out. <laughs> Let's try this again. <laughs> Should I um, take them with me? I don't even know. Come on, don't be scared. I'm not gonna hurt you. There we go. Me and the boys. Oh no, they got stuck. <laughs> Come on. This game looks awesome so far. I, uh, I really like it. Okay, so I'm guessing... Yep. Perfect. And I think we can use. Yep. Oh, I scared them. I scared them again. Oh, come on. Um. The uh, the mushrooms help us regen some uh, some energy back. And by energy, I mean the uh, arrows, I guess, for the um, for the bow. Demonic forest spirit. Well, okay. Oh, come on. Of course. Of course. Oh, of course. <laughs> this is what happens when you <laughs> try to act cool. Do the arrows deal any damage? I hope so. Now, 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 now. Be nice. There we go. Look at him. Look how happy he is. <laughs> and... Bam. <laughs> Look at them just... <laughs> That's so cool. Hmm. Well, uh, what now? <laughs> Are you guys coming with me?
Nope, apparently not. What happened if I went the other way with them? Like the... on the... Um, on the actual entrance. Hmm. So, apparently we get smacked in the head by sword hilt? I think by this guy? Yeah, you better run, old man. I'm gonna kick your butt. Um, and he steals our soul, and I think we are trying to get it back, I assume. <laughs> okay, this is a life seed. Planting one of these in the green pot will yield soul fruit, uh, which can be consumed to restore your health. Cool. Let's tick, 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 tick. let's climb the uh, the ladder and should we go this way? Yeah, why not? Is this the right way though? Bruh, <laughs> he didn't even attack me. Uh, what is this? Oh, it's the uh, it's like a save, I guess. And we get a mass soul, um, a mass of soul energy. Soul energy can be spent in the Hall of Doors on Reapers to upgrade. On Reaper upgrade, sorry. I'm guessing for this we need... Yeah, I think we need something to burn it off. They seem so uh, docile. <laughs> Is it because it's a beginner friendly area or are they just not very active in general? Uh, did we miss anything around here? Hmm, I don't think we did. So we're gonna keep on rolling. <laughs> Literally. Okay, so from what I understood, uh, there's a... I don't know if there's a limited number of pots or not. Or if you just can... Or if you can just use it once. And then, yeah, I think it regens when you die, basically. Okay, so... It's kind of scary, because... Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is this? Oh! Whoa, that's so cool. Does it go back? Whoa. This is so cool. I'm not doing this. The uh, the game is doing this. What is this? An undying blossom. What does it do? Uh, its stagnant aura is telling uh, of the strange state of this island. Okay. What? And why, what do I do with it? Um, this flower's petals are soft and delicate, yet its appearances, uh, appearance is withered and grey, as if uh, it were both alive and dead. The forces that resonate through this place seem to allow, allow life to continue even beyond its natural point of conclusion. Okay. Okay. Oh, you can actually rotate them. That's so cool. So, we don't really know what we can use it for, but... Oh, well. <laughs> Maybe we will find out in the, uh, in the future. And we picked up a key. I'm guessing it's the one for, uh, for the door that was locked when we, uh, when we started. Uh, what am I... What is this? This way to the summit. Okay. Well, let me explore first. Who knows, maybe there's something else we might have missed.
Oh, I think this is the... Uh, yep. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that was close. I think this is the area from the uh, gameplay trailer or whatever. Oh, you wish, boy. You wish. Oh my god, I thought he died. Well, that was unfortunate. I thought he died. That's why I didn't bother with him. And down they go. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh, they can hit each other? Oh, that's so cool. Oh, no, 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 no. Wow, the stone actually stays there. Oh my god, am I gonna die? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's let's chill for a moment. Okay. I was laughing because uh, they got stuck in the in the other stones, but apparently so do I. So. <laughs> oh, I don't have another seed. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Am I already heading towards the uh, towards my first death? Oh no, I hope not. <laughs> uh, let me let me check the area around here first. Nothing. Okay. Can I hit these? Well, I can, but it doesn't seem like it does much. Ah, a reaper. My time in this world is over. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. No? Hmm, no. Still here and still very much alive. Perhaps try a bit of a run-up? Uh, do you mean this? Yep. I'm sorry, it's not your fault. It happens to everyone. <laughs> I'm afraid I am burdened with unending life. I can't explain it. I've spent untold, uh, untold years seeking an answer. My name is Ted Hone. I am the keeper of greys in uh, on this sacred mountain. Oh, and if you do find yourself strengthened somehow, feel free to try and kill me again. Well, okay then. <laughs> that's a that's a bit of a weird request, but uh, sure. Uh, what is this? Here lies a guardian of the door, a preserver of order, and a home to stray souls. Okay, this kind of looks like the uh, the boss. I think is it the boss? I don't know. Please give me a seed or something. I need some life. Please. <laughs> I don't want to. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. No. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Oh my God. Oh, that's a seed. That's a seed right here. Uh, but can I plant it anywhere near? Should I go back to where I was? Yeah, I'm gonna go back to where I was. I'm, uh... I don't want to fail in the first episode. <laughs> I want to make a good impression for you guys, you know? Like, hey, this guy knows what he's doing, right? <laughs> was it here? Yeah, it was here. Let's consume it and go back to um, to where we came from. I'm sorry about the uh, the back and forth, but um, hey, I need to I need to look good, okay? <laughs> Please uh, bear with it. Is this the yeah? This is the right way. So we've been down here. Should we go here now? Uh, sure. 
Oh, is this the bridge the uh, the old guy was on? And I think we were down here. Okay, then uh, this is basically the last path that we are going to take. Because um, I want to explore the uh, the area a little bit. I didn't really get to do much when I, when I played earlier because it was going so, you know, um, so poorly. Uh, what is this? Uh, the simple structure has a twin. The hidden secret lies within. Oh, is it the... Oh, I think it's the uh, the flower one, right? The uh, the undying flower or whatever that was. Uh, for this thing, I think we need a fire spell, like a fireball or something. So there's not much we can do here. Which means we can go towards the uh, the quest. This way to the summit. Yeah, I uh, I figured that much. But wait, let me... Should we go? Yeah, you know what, let's go. Ooh, I see a seed down there. Nice, 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 nice. What? No way you can do a jump attack. Oh my god, that's so freaking cool. <laughs> Anything else around here? Nope. Anything else around here? Nope. Uh, let's see, so... We took the... Sort of... Path to the... Uh, southeast, I suppose. Uh, I think there was another path this way. Uh, was it? Oh, we've already been... Oh, there's nothing here. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Jesus Christ, I did not see the huge freaking ladder. <laughs> uh, what do we have here? Nothing? Okay. Is this a magic door? Nope. Okay. We're rolling. We're rolling. And... Oh, wait a minute, I've already been here. I'm sorry, guys. I feel like I'm miss missing a portion of the uh, the map. And I'm kind of trying to figure out where it is. Am I missing, though, a portion of the map? Hmm. I am not very sure. So we came down. Hmm. Maybe it's just my imagination. So we've been here. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm definitely lost a little bit. <laughs> but uh, I guess that's what I get for uh, going back and forth again and again. Yeah. Okay, we've been here as well. We've unlocked this one. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna move on and Am I moving on this way? I'm so oh oh wait a minute. Okay, anything else around here? Nope. Anything else around Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. I hope I can... I don't fall over the uh, the wall. Pray at Shrine. Oh, I think this is... Uh, I think it gives you pieces of crystals, if I'm not mistaken. Or something like that. Okay. The ancient shrine offers you a shard from a vitality crystal. Why is it towards the left and not in the middle though? <laughs> that's, that's a bit weird. Uh, collecting four will raise your vitality beyond its limits. Maybe the other pieces, uh, pieces are like next to this one. And that's why it was like crooked. 
But hey, we managed to find something cool. I really, really like this idea with the uh, turning around. I'm guessing there's no way we can pierce this, right? Nope. No, okay then. Whoa, 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 come on, bruh. Is that the best you can do? Uh, one thing that I don't particularly like, you cannot animation, cancel, dash, whatever. You're kind of locked in it. In a way. So, I gotta make sure I don't over uh, overcommit in certain... You know, certain situations. Oh, and we get another seed. Let's drop kill this guy. Okay. And very nice. Uh, I'm not sure which one. Yeah, I'm guessing something big happens here since uh, <laughs> since it zoomed out like that. So I'm going to go back and check the uh, the left side. And nothing here. Okay. And nope, I don't think so. And nothing here either. I kind of like this idea of, you know, not having uh, all of the, the paths open. And, you know, you need to get some items to, to be able to do them. I'm not a huge fan of it. Like... Sometimes it kind of feels annoying, like, am I doing something wrong, and why can't I go through this door, and stuff like that, but... Oh, hey now. What are you? Well... Oh, wait. Did he die, or did he... teleport or something? Oh my god. That was so... Out of the blue. Yeah, I can do that too. There you go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you wish. Oh, I'm facing the wrong... No way! <laughs> oh, I can dodge underneath the... Wait a minute, he can freaking fly? Can I dodge underneath the... Yep. That's so cool. Bam. Who can play that game, bruh? Where are you? Oh, and I just pushed it. God damn it. How many waves are... <laughs> I don't know. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No, 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 no. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> I'm really enjoying this so far. I think it's pretty freaking awesome. Nothing to do here? Nothing? What about this gargoyle? Nope. Okay. Never mind. Then. Is this the right way? I, <laughs> I don't even remember at this point. I think this is the right way. Uh, can I open this? Probably from the other side. Okay, and this... Oh, this is next to the... Um, whatever, that thing. Okay. Um, should we get another heal in before we uh, we actually move on? I don't remember where it was. Come on, we've been in one in uh, next to one recently, haven't we? Hmm. Let me go check a little bit. So first, I thought the that uh, I, th I thought these things are like shields. 
chill plates but they're actually arrow charges which means that if you get hit four times you're basically dead i don't know why i find that kind of um, nerve-wracking like just four chances and that's it okay oh boy what already why i thought this was like guardian of the door okay i thought that this guy's like a, one of the whoa, whoa wait what can i sit here oh you're a dead boy <laughs> uh, i thought that this guy is going to be one of the like what he can freaking fly, really. I didn't remember this. Wait, wait, what, 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 what? No, wait. Can I spin? Oh yeah, I can spin. <laughs> You'll have to, no. Oh my God. I gotta. I gotta stop. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. No, 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 no. Okay. 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 That wasn't too hard. Now, do I need to charge the arrow for max, uh, max damage or... Why are you running? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, I, I can see the small freaking targets. Oh my god, oh my god. No. I thought maybe. Yep, of course, I. Can this hit me? Do I take damage? Oh, that would be hilarious. Oh no, I don't take damage. I was just about to say uh, that I hoped I can defeat him without taking any damage. And then he hit me and then he died. So that pretty much sums up my life. Um, this way to the overgrown ruins. Well, I don't have any fire spells, so I guess we're not going anywhere. <laughs> what is this? Uh, this way to the summit. Okay. Uh, okay, how do I open this one? Oh, I just... Uh, hmm. Is uh, This grave is next to the guy who cannot die. What if this is his grave? Ooh, what is this? Uh, on the door next to him, there's like six circles um and it kind of looked like you, you can place something in them what if it's like one of these things you have to kill him bury him and you will get like a mask and you can put it on the door and that would be kind of cool uh what did we do though I think something opened, but I'm... What is that? Can I get there? I mean, I know it's a mass soul, but what is this? Hmm. I don't think there's a way I can get there. I mean, I can see you can climb off there, but... I don't know. And we planted a new seed. I don't know if I'm being wasteful with them, or if, you know, every level has enough plant you know every seed um or to plant a seed in every pot i should rather say um okay so what is that he found some incense uh this stuff smells uh very strong okay and that's it that's Oh, look, uh, these are the, um, 
or maybe you add more masks to this and you open the door i thought that maybe you put the masks uh the masks in the in the door but i see some on the wall so maybe that's how you open it i don't even know but it's definitely interesting so uh, where are we supposed to go so that thing is locked do we move forward am i missing something holy oh i i always feel like i'm missing something oh you're getting it oh you're getting it bruh mm-hmm turn around bruh what is that sorry about the um uh, the crack on your head but i needed that soul well everybody freaking needs it you see i was a reaper just like you years ago my assignment evaded capture it took many months to track it down to this location upon arrival i discovered it had somehow passed through this door inconceivable do you know where we are fledgling fledgling i think uh we're uh we're in this door what do you mean where we are oh <laughs> yeah <laughs> so this is like the final door like like is this i'm confused i said we're in the game but is this the like the actual death door the end point for all life i thought it was just a legend oh so it is like the the door as you know all doors are powered by the energy of souls perhaps with a truly monumental amount of power even this one could be forced open sadly the soul i stole from you was not enough how is this my problem like <laughs> i'm afraid that our fates are very much intertwined now fledgling well it's your freaking fault you hit me in the head and stole my soul and then you i don't know used it i suppose for with your assignment incomplete your death is now um, an inevitability that was a hard word um well, it's your fault. Without the soul that now resides behind this door, you are trapped just like me. Well, thank you. He did not only manage to, uh, you know, trap himself. Now he trapped me. Bruh, your plan is not working. You're making things worse. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Look, uh, look around his neck. He has uh, a mask as well. Is that the same style of mask as the other ones anyway uh however fortune may still smile upon us this cursed land is hidden to the reapers oh somehow untouched by the laws of nature the creatures here have the potential to live vastly beyond their years growing even uh, ever larger and more powerful I know of three such beings as these isles um, whose combined soul energy could grant us the power to wedge this door open. To the north lives an old witch obsessed with, ex uh, with escaping the clutches of death. Beyond the forest to the east self proclaimed king rules over the ruins of a flooded cathedral okay and atop the mountain to the west a beast of untold years primal and vicious with no want or desire okay i'm truly sorry to have entangled you fledgling yeah mm -hmm. i'm sure you are but in my advanced ears, my body grows weary. 
your path is now your own no it's not you freaking forced me on this freaking path because you stole my freaking soul you freaking old gray crow either venture uh, venture into the wilds and reap those um giant souls or choose inaction and suffer the same fate as this old fool you are a freaking fool so um no not really yeah yeah i know i know yeah i know i know okay thank you thank you actually no thank you this whole this is all your fault so where the oh never mind okay and i'm guessing this is the door it opens yep cool very cool so far i'm really enjoying this this way uh to the urn witch's mansion okay let's just uh pull the lever and is this another shortcut or oh i know where we are okay that's cool so a lot of shortcuts so far okay and that's the way towards the uh, the witch and this is the way to what this door requires a key to open yeah i i couldn't <laughs> ah, i kind of noticed the uh, the giant lock on it uh, and the keyhole looks very old and rusted okay then well then um i guess this is uh, this is going to be uh, this is going to be it for today guys um this was awesome <laughs> there's not much else that i can say i had fun uh, i think the game looks great it's it's great <laughs> there's, not, there's not much that i can say i'm a little bit um uh, first of all i'm really upset about the whole uh thing with the dropped frames like i tried installing it uninstalling it changing the hard drive it was installed on uh, installed on everything i could have um everything i could think of to uh, get it to work and it didn't and i wasted so much time on this and yeah that's that, uh, that was a pretty rocky start i'm not gonna lie um so that would be my first rush, uh, frustration and the second one i don't know if this is just something that i need to get used to it but i was hoping i could dodge at any time not just you know after the uh animation is over i hope that makes sense but um other than that i uh, i think it's awesome and i can't wait to play even more uh for you guys now if you'll excuse me i actually have to jump into a different <laughs> Uh, game so that i can record that as well thank you so much for uh, joining me in today's adventure and thank you so much for joining me in a whole new series and i will see you next time take care